in this video, I want to show you guys how to use the clone tool in Affinity Photo. So I have this picture right here, and what I want to do is have the leaves cover the entire picture. So I want to get rid of the brick wall, and I want the leaves to be all over the picture. So how I do that is we're going to use the clone tool, which is right here and just click on it and um, make sure that when you're doing that you have your hardness level at 0% because if you have it at 100% you're going to have really sharp edges once you start copying things. Okay, so I'm going to start and I'm going to choose a point where I want to where I want to start copying. So I'm going to click Alt on, if you're using a Mac, you click Alt and click to choose a starting point. So I'm going to choose a starting point around here. So this is my starting point. And now I'm just going to drag across the picture. And as I drag, you see that the starting point also moves. And it's just indicating you where you're copying your what section you're copying it from so we're just gonna keep dragging and just be careful on the edges because we don't want to cover her face and right here you see that I started copying her arm so we don't want that we're just going to command C and we're going to start a new starting point so I'll click and I'm going to start my new starting point here and I'm going to start clicking and dragging. Okay. So I got our arm again. So let's start choosing another point to start. So I'm going to start right here again. And you see that everything starts blending in perfectly right now. Okay, let's go down and let's get rid of this pipe or I don't know what that is right here. We're going to get rid of it. And yeah, we pretty much want the brick walls gone. Alright, so I'm going to zoom in, make my brush smaller right here because you have to be careful to not get hair hair all filled with leaves so just be careful on this section okay so this is what it looks like having all the pictures with leaves so I think it looks so much nicer than having half the picture with leaves and the and the other half with bricks so right here I don't really like this brick, so I want to get rid of it. I'm just going to copy some flowers down here to get rid of this brick. So I think that looks fairly nice. Okay, so here's our finished picture, and I think it looks really good. So that's how you use the clone tool in Affinity Photo. 